What's up guys, how's it going? This is Joseph Composted here doing another product review. You guys really enjoyed my Better Dynamic DT77 Pro headphones versus the Audio-Technica M50X headphones. Got good feedback on that, you guys enjoyed my analysis. And I was like, I have three microphones, why not make a microphone video? Okay, so I'm gonna get right into it. Jump right into it. This is the Blue Baby Bottle SL, okay? And I have the Audio-Technica AT4040 and then I have the Neumann TLM 102 okay so let's start with the Audio Technica because that's the first one I got right so this is the Audio Technica AT4040 this microphone about $300 AT4040 nice crisp black finish definitely looks like a professional studio microphone the sound on this is very very clear very clear, but like a lot of less expensive studio microphones, it wants to replicate the sound of a very expensive studio microphone. So of course there's some color on it. The color on the Audio-Technica AT4040, the color is in the high end. I listen to myself on this and the high end, you know, you got the highs, upper mids, mids, lower mids, sub. The higher end upper mids sounds compressed, sounds tight. It's been touched. You can tell there's a little bit of shine, a little bit of sheen on that high end on the Audio-Technica AT4040. However, this is an extremely well-rounded microphone. It's good on female vocals, female and male vocals. It has a little low cut, kind of high pass filter on there. It also has a DB pad in case you have like noise, hit the fan on, boom, fan noise goes away. AT4040 is a very clear microphone. The high end is kind of colored though. So depending on your voice, how you want your voice to sound, it will affect the way your higher end sounds on your voice. But if you got this microphone, I, you would not be disappointed. I don't believe you'd be disappointed. You'd be happy with this purchase, okay? Then we have the blue baby bottle. Obviously a very different look than the Audio-Technica 4040, right? Kind of a vintage -y aesthetic. Let's not act like the way things look doesn't sometimes contribute um, to us making the purchase. This has a nice look. This looks different. The Blue is a very nice brand. They're very popular headphones. Also has that noise reduction. Also has a high pass filter, okay? Now, the way this sounds and the Audio-Technica 4040 are comparable. They're both very clear headphones. This is about $400. They're both in that range that's three to 400 to 500 bucks. However, this also does have color, and the color on this is not really so much in the high end. The color's on the lower mids, okay? So you have that airy part of your vocal on a microphone, and then you have that body, that oomph, that lower mids. On the baby bottle, the lower mids is kind of it, it sounds to me like saturation. It's heated. There's some sizzle. So if you listen to the Audio Technica, it will almost sound clearer because the higher end is kind of pushed out more. If you listen to the blue, it is just as clear. But on the lower part of the voice, there is some heat, some sizzle. It's been, it's almost like slight distortion on the lower mids that can sound good though. This is not a negative. For your voice, this could be the best microphone in the world for you. It has a little bit of saturation on the lower mids. For me personally, didn't love it. Um, I said I was going in order. This is the third mic I got. The Neumann was the second one. I didn't love the way I sounded on this. However, guys, you may love the way you sound on this. Um, artist shout out, Russ loved this microphone. Got me going psycho. He made hit that song with this microphone. For his voice, that was the best possible thing. And that's important to remember while I do this kind of short, quick review on these microphones. The best one is the one that sounds the best for you. The one you sound the best on. The one you sound the best on. Okay? Blue microphone, real nice aesthetic here. Comes with this nice shock mount. Audio Technica 4040 also came with the shock mount. Very clear microphone, well-rounded. If you got this, I don't believe you'd be disappointed. If you guys are coming from like a $50 USB mic, any one of these, you're going to be happy with, I promise. But this one, the body of the vocal is tampered with. There's a little bit of heat on it. it sounds like saturation to my ears. Okay. Let's go ahead and look at the second one I actually purchased. Where'd it go? Oh, where'd it go? 
the Norman TLM 102. Okay? Now, no knobs, no switches on this microphone. There's nothing to do. This microphone is, excuse me, is eight. This microphone is 800 bucks. I know you guys are like, Joey, I ain't got 800 bucks to spend on a microphone. Why are you using this one in comparison to those? Well, guys, because I didn't have $800 to spend on this microphone either. I made this in payments, okay? Check out sites like Zounds, American Musical Supply, Sweetwater. There are sites, no credit check, low interest to no interest, where you can make payments. I paid this microphone off over a year, okay? Neumann TLM 102. This one's the quickest because it's so simple. This microphone is just very clear, okay? Very clear, and in the high end, there's a little presence boost. It's that Neumann presence boost. In the high end, you'll hear it. It's almost like, um, sounds creamy. If you've listened to the CLA preamps, CLA 2A, it almost sounds like it's putting this cream on your voice. That's what this sounds like, okay? Why? Because it's a Neumann microphone. All these brands, all brands have their color on their sound, their sound signature. That's why audiophiles love it, right? Everything has its own sound signature and it's just nice to be able to hear how everything plays the same thing in a different way. For me, for my voice, I enjoy, yes, the way, Jasper, I enjoy the way I sound on this. But you guys may like this and not like the way you sound on it. You may like the way you sound more on a blue microphone. You may like that lower mids presence that this has. You may just like the way it looks more. Let's not act like it's not a contributing factor. And it's much cheaper, guys. And if you feel like this does something you don't like, well, you can fix that in production, you can fix that in EQing it, okay? And then when it comes to the Audio Technica 4040, these sound more similar, but the higher end on this has been touched more. There's more color, there's more of a compressed feel on the high end of the AT4040 than this. This sounds more clear. Now, why is it so expensive? Guys, it's a Norman microphone. This is the cheapest Norman microphone. This TLM 102. Why did I get it? Because Drake used a 103, okay? I'm just, I mean, come on, let's be honest. And I didn't want to pop out the extra 300 bucks for the 103, okay? So quick recap. Audio Technica 4040 has a high pass filter, noise reduction, very nice black finish, looks like a studio microphone, it looks good, $300, very clear, well rounded microphone, if you got this you wouldn't be disappointed, the high end is where the color is and it sounds compressed, this is not a bad thing, for me, I didn't love it compared to the Neumann, for you, this could be the best microphone in the world, okay, if you got this, I don't think you'd be disappointed. If you get the blue microphone, you're also getting an extremely clear microphone. This baby bottle, blue baby bottle, is an extremely clear microphone. The lower body part sounds like it has some sizzle, sounds like it has some heat. Comes with shock mount, $400, also has a noise reduction, also has the high pass filter. Okay, the Neumann TLM 102 does not have noise reduction, does not have high pass filter, 8 hundred dollars but it's an overall just extremely clear microphone and in the high end has that little presence boost just a subtle creamy little little effect on your vocal I like it on my voice it doesn't necessarily mean you're gonna like it on your voice okay because I'm letting friends borrow these other microphones and guess what they love them they love the AT4040 and they love the blue I borrowed them for make this video, and you know they want them back. They're loving these microphones. So just because this one's more expensive doesn't mean it's a better microphone. It's just very important to remember that you could grab a $50 microphone, and you love the way you sound on it, but you hate the way you sound on this one. This is just reality, and those higher ups in the music industry know that. Just because it's the most expensive microphone does not mean it's going to sound better. Just because they're the most expensive speakers doesn't mean it's going to sound better. The only thing that matters is you like the way it sounds. Okay? So I hope I maybe narrowed down and gave some very clear explanation on the microphones, the blue Audio Technica Neumann. Um, very soon I'm going to be posting Beats on here for you guys to be able to go to BeatStars and grab them, lease them if you want to, and then I'll, every once in a while I'll show me making a beat. Got great feedback on the headphone video. Hope I get also great feedback on this video, just trying to give you guys straightforward information on exactly how they sound. Okay, hope you guys have a good day. See you next episode.